Yeah, so Tommy could do like a little get ready with me because I'm going out tonight. It's currently it's currently quarter past seven and I like to just get out of the shower. Well I didn't just get out, I have to put on another load of laundry, so I always have to blow dry my hair. So I'm gonna put on we'll put in my hair just I don't I can never pronounce this brand but because my hair is so damaged I need to like keep it up tacked because I dye it like fifty times. Um but this Kirsty resistance is like pretty much a heat protector. So I'm gonna put that on my hair and then we're gonna start blow drying it. Okay, I blow dry my hair, you can definitely tell I need to straighten it. But I'll not straighten it until um I do my makeup. Like there's still a bit damp in it, but it's mostly dry by the time I finish my makeup and that it will be pretty much dry because once the majority of it's dry i find that my hair like dries so much more quicker if there's like damp spots if the majority of it's dry but um my face is really dry so i'm gonna take some cotton pads and use the nivea micellar water to kind of clean my face because i don't want it to be dry applying makeup because it's gonna be extra dry when i put on makeup Okay, so I'm gonna start my makeup. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna put a headband on so my hair is like fully out of my way. Um, or whatever, but um, my hair actually looks quite bright in this light in, which is good. Um, but to prep my face, I'm going to use the Seraphine moisturiser, which is like my go-to moisturiser. And then I'm just going to put on the Bondi Sand sunscreen, even though it's currently snowing right now. But it just gives an extra layer of moisturiser. Next, I'm going to take the Be Perfect Cosmetics Instruct Brow Lock and Load. So my brows and I'm in the shade Hydrate Brown. So I'm gonna fill in my brows. Okay, I accidentally forgot to fill to film um filling in my brows, but it's fine. Next we're gonna move on to foundation and I'm gonna use my NARS foundation. Um and I'm probably gonna use my Revolution concealer and then set it with um Rimmel. The rubble powder I was spraying um my beauty blender with the um NYX setting spray so there's a little bit of moisturizer moisture <laughs> moist in my beauty spent blender spender blender that's the word Okay, so the like my kind of not my base is done because I still have some, I can also brush, but anyway, um, the concealer and that is done. Um, so next is I can't even speak today. Like my mind's just in a different place. We're gonna contour using the so so. Um, cream contour stick. I now have the hiccups, which is really what I need. Um, before I go out, um, so ever since I started using cream contour, I've never looked back. I think it's probably like the favorite purchase I've ever made, and I'm just gonna like. Blend it in with my beauty blender. I'm kind of going for like a more natural look today for going out because I just can't be bothered. Like, I 
um, actually try. Um, I'm probably gonna straighten my hair off camera. Because that does take a while, and I normally like to watch, like, YouTube or something. Whilst I, um, straightening my hair. Um. I'm gonna beat her face. Um. I kind of, well, I'm gonna do blush. Um. I'm sorry for the background noise. I live in a shit of accommodation. I can't really control the sound control. Um, but I forgot my passport at home. So, um, have my student ID, which some places don't take your student ID, but some places do. It just depends. But I did get my mom to like send me a picture of my ID, like my passport. So I'm also gonna bring like my student ID with me. Um or whatever, but I'm also gonna have the picture of my passport on my phone as a backup and just kind of explain that I literally just came off from college and I genuinely forgot to pack it. But I'll have it the next time. Be quiet and it should be fine. Um literally done my makeup i just need to put on mascara but first i'm going to set it with the next spray that you seen me use earlier um oh, hot weather my mouth lastly i'm going to take the ps lash extension and um, mascara uh just do my eyelashes you definitely cannot see. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna straighten my hair. Um, after I do this, and then when I'm fully ready, I still have no idea what I want. I kind of have a rough idea because like. I, my legs are just covered in bruises right now because I always fall and ride out so I don't really want to wear a dress um, or whatever because you're gonna see bruises and I don't want to, I don't really want to see bruises um, so I think I'm gonna wear maybe trousers um like but like i do not know well, this is my makeup it's very natural um whatever i'm gonna have to straighten my hair but like i'll give it a couple of minutes before i like actually straighten my hair because i feel like it takes me the longest to do my makeup and it literally takes me like five minutes to straighten my hair and like, well, it is only quarter to eight right now. We're not leaving until ten, so I still have plenty of time. Okay, I've decided to curl my hair, which I quite like. I like that it turned out. Now I just have to decide what I'm wearing. So this is final. I'm excited to go with a green dress. Um, because I haven't, girl, I haven't worn this dress in a while, and it's like like this so i think she's quite cute but yeah that was a little bit like, get ready to meet with me i think i did pretty well considering it's 25 to 9 and i'm still the first person to be ready even though i was the last person to start getting ready but it's all good so thank you for watching this video i'm gonna get try get it posted before i go out so I don't forget or yeah i'm gonna start editing it now before i start drinking because it's gonna be bad if i try to edit while being under the influence so yeah thank you for watching this video and i'll see you soon